Our planet is full of diverse and fascinating creatures, many of which have strange traits and characteristics that have to be seen to be believed. It's no different when it comes to insects, as some of them have excelled at becoming evolutionary wonders, developing mind-blowing camouflage to protect themselves in their natural habitat. Because of this, many people have opted to keep them as pets, despite the difficulties they will have. Welcome to another episode of Forever Green. If you're curious about the truly magnificent insects that people keep as pets, you will want to hang around until the very end to see an insect that is definitely not what it seems. 10. Spiny Stick Insect Despite its name, this species of stick insect looks more like a cactus than a twig. Its body is bulky and covered in small spines used for camouflage and protection. On its legs, the big lobes look like leaves of a desert plant. The spiny stick insect is usually a light brown color, but occasionally can be green, beige, or dark brown. There's also a rare color variation called lichen that only comes with the female gender of this insect. Their color is believed to develop based on their environment and what they eat, but doesn't always guarantee a specific color. Apart from the color, the difference between the males and females is actually very huge, literally. The females are bulky, thick, and can grow to 15 centimeters long. They have lots of spines on their back and large lobes on their legs. The males, on the other hand, are really slender, have little spines, and reach a length of 12 centimeters. Like the other insect pets you will see throughout this list, the spiny stick insect is far from being a traditional pet. 9. Sunset Moth The Madagascar sunset moth was first described in 1773 by Drew Dury, who is a collector of insects. Originally, Dury thought the insect was a butterfly because of its stunning markings, but it was later identified as a moth instead. Because of these markings, it is regarded as one of the most beautiful moths in existence. During the Victorian era, the moths were hunted and turned into jewelry, becoming incredibly popular during the period. Fortunately, the species never became endangered by the level they were hunted and are quite common. Number three on our list, however, is so rare that it wasn't discovered until 2009 and was even believed to be an internet hoax. Just like the sunset moth population, we are trying to grow as big as we possibly can on this channel. Why not help us by hitting that like button? as well as the subscribe and notification buttons. 8. Praying Mantis Praying Mantis are fascinating insects that are often kept as pets. They hunt prey by using their strong spiky front legs to clap onto smaller insects and stop them from escaping. A mantis has a flexible neck that can turn around just like a human's large eyes, four legs, and often vary in length, typically between 1 and 16 centimeters. What makes the mantis an ideal insect pet choice is that they don't have any poison in them. Although you may be familiar with the appearance of the praying mantis, there are actually over 2,300 species of them living on every continent in the world. Except for Antarctica, where they would struggle to find a meal that isn't ice with a side of snow. Although many people may have seen a mantis in Spain, France, or in the US, the highest population belongs to the tropical forests of South America, Africa, and Asia. Seven, Luna Moth. The Luna Moth has broad pale green wings and delicate tail streamers making it one of the most interesting and uniquely marked insects in the world. They have a wingspan of 3 to 4.5 inches, and their larvae can grow up to 3.5 inches long. It is sometimes known as the American Moon Moth, as it only flies at night, with an official name of an Axios Luna. The Luna Moth's beautiful appearance has been popular among people for many years. 
even making an appearance on a U.S. first-class stamp that was issued in 1987. Most recently, an animated version of the Luna Moth featured in commercials for Lunesta, despite them sharing a similar name. I'm not sure if the moth was the right choice to promote a sleep aid product. I mean, it's famous for staying up all night. If you are just like the Luna Moth and prefer to stay up late, give us a thumbs up on this video. 6. Membrosis Mexicana This next entry has a name that you can only pronounce sober, the Membrosis Mexicana, also known as a tree hopper. Has incredibly striking colors and shapes that they use for camouflage when sitting on similarly colorful flowers. Regarded as the ugly duckling of the insect world, the tree hopper starts off completely black and develops its brilliant colors as it grows older. There are only 50 known species of Membrosis, which makes some rarer than others. The tree hopper is often chosen as a pet, but one mistake would be handling it. As like a mosquito with humans and animals, this insect has a bite that can penetrate a tree's bark, so it can eat the sap. Like a mosquito's saliva stops our blood from coagulating and closing the wound, the tree hopper stops the tree from closing up the area, making it an all-you-can-eat buffet for the little bug. Despite their attractive look, it is considered a minor pest and can even spread deadly diseases among humans. Do you have a pet at home that would love unlimited access to food? Let us know in the comment section below. 5. The Caddy Did Leaf Bug The Caddy Did gets its name from the bizarre sound it makes, as the repetitive clicking sounds like someone saying, Catty Did. This insect is closely related to crickets and grasshoppers, with large legs for jumping. Unlike grasshoppers, Caddy Dids have extremely long antennae. Their bodies have a kite like shape with four equal lengths. They have wings that allow them to fly away from danger, with most sightings occurring when they land on an object. In fact, some people may have come across these insects while driving in their car, as the uninvited hitchhikers try and latch on. The adults of the species are extremely good at camouflaging on trees, as their bodies resemble a green leaf, even having leaf-like veins running throughout. Catydids will stay still when they think they are in danger and will quickly fly away before they are harmed. Catydids choose to eat the leaves from the top of trees, and this is where fewer predators will find them. They often change their vivid colors through the seasons and can be found in places with plenty of greenery. For those looking to keep one as a pet, however, should know that they are most active in the summer months, but do prefer places like Florida, where it is hot all the time. 4. Atlas Moth An atlas moth is one of the sneakiest insects around. It will rest on a tree trunk with its wings closed, not worried about becoming dinner for bigger prey. You see, if a bird comes along hoping for a snack, the atlas moth will open up its wings and shows off its deceiving markings that look like two cobra heads. Confused and startled, the bird will fly away and the moth gets to live another day. Specialists believe that these unique markings are a form of visual mimicry, learning over thousands of years that some birds hate snakes and will not approach them. This extraordinary gift makes it popular among insect collectors as well as artists and photographers. If you think that an insect that looks like a snake is interesting, wait until you see the next entry. But before we get stuck into that, why not subscribe to the channel and help us grow? 3. Venezuelan Poodle Moth The Venezuelan poodle moth mystified researchers and baffled the internet when pictures of it went viral, soon after its discovery in 2009. At a glance, the insect looks like a combination of a large moth and a bright, fluffy white poodle, causing many to claim that the images had to be photoshopped. However, the doubts were put to bed when the Venezuelan poodle moth was captured on film by Dr. Arthur Anker of Mishkek, Kyrgyzstan. 
Another researcher, Dr. Carl Schuker, took an interest in the fuzzy white creature with bulging black eyes and strange brown antennae. He used his background in zoology, cryptozoology, and science writing to showcase the animal on his blog. Since the moth was put in the spotlight, it has been a much sought after pet for collectors looking for something cute and rare. Two, the monarch butterfly. The monarch is the largest butterfly seen in the British Isles and is also one of the rarest. Known for its ability to travel large distances, its population in North America is one of the strangest natural phenomena in the world. In recent years, monarch butterflies have significantly dropped in numbers due to their natural landscapes being developed, pesticides being sprayed, and global climate change. Over in the US, they are working to have the monarch butterfly protected under the Endangered Species Act. So. If anyone wants to grab themselves this stunning insect as a pet, they will have to take very good care of it, or else it could land you in trouble. Before we get into our final unbelievable insect, it's time to take a look at today's subscriber's pick. This picture showing a stunning flower mantis looks absolutely mesmerizing, as its vibrant colors look like a pair of painted eyes staring at you. The flower mantis doesn't only look this way to win bug beauty contests, as the floral appearance means that it can disguise itself as a flower to stop prey eating it. If you come across any picture online that you would like us to take a look at and discuss, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and submit your awesome finds. If today's subscriber pick has piqued your interest in this fascinating insect, why don't we tell you a little bit more about it? 1. Flower Mantis Often found in South Africa, flower mantises are a type of praying mantis that look just like flowers. Much like the atlas moth, they have the ability to mimic the colors of bright flowers as a form of camouflage, which lures their prey to them. The females are larger and more vibrant in color, with legs that look unbelievable like orchid petals. The males, however, never evolved to have a floral appearance. In fact, they are much smaller and dull looking. So, just be careful next time you are out picking flowers. You may just find yourself holding a flower mantis instead. 2. If you enjoy videos just like this one that dive into strange and fascinating creatures, why not check out our top 10 uncommon animals people have taken a ride on?